Yes, lads, welcome back to another video on the channel. So, we're going to talk about what I've been doing. We went for a video earlier, just explaining really what would be a good idea to do. And I'm not going to tell you to do something that I don't do. So, I'm actually going to explain what I've done, what I'm doing. And um, yeah, we'll see if it works out in the next couple of days, right? So, first of all, I picked up some Dell Arts. I picked them up for about 17, 18, 5, 17, 5, 17, 5. Uh, and then we picked up, there's one here that I tried to lazy sell. Just to get a few, just to see if I could flip him, because I am looking for about 23, 24 for him anyway. Uh, I reckon, or even 22, 23 is a good price for him. Uh, we know about these already. We um, we don't need chemistry at the moment for SBC, so that's why that didn't work out. We picked up a few Timo Berners at 7577, seven, seven, um, just based on the fact that he might be going up. Um, so hopefully he could go up where he's coming into Team of the Week, so that's why we've picked up him. Hazard is the same reason as Navas is. Uh, Chiellini at 1-4, which I don't know what I'm doing with. Um, he's up to like 2-3 or something. Maybe just get that. Rafael Leal, I did say this, I think yesterday, or it wasn't yesterday, it was today, this morning. Um, I said this would be a good card to buy. Um, and he's up to about 23, I think. Um, maybe a little bit more. So that's good because he's in the team of the week. Same with Ben Yeller, I picked one up for 25. Uh, he's up to about 31, which is good signs. Jorginho at 4.4, um, he's up to about 7.5, which that's where his kind of 85 price range is. Um, and then Thiago Silva's at 7.1, um, 11.25, which is a recent one. I've just done a quick flip, but he's up to 14, so we're all good on that. And then 5k, 7.1, 5k, 5k, uh, 10k, so we can sell the higher rated ones. We've got a trend that we packed from the start of the game. Which we're just waiting to sell is about 18k, I think, 17k. Hurricanes, we picked up. I did say pick up Hurricane um, a few weeks ago, maybe, no, not a few weeks ago, maybe four or five days ago. I said 19k is way too cheap for him to pick him up. He's 38 now, so that was a good call. Um, if I had a million coins, I would have probably put it all in Kane, but there we go. And then I've picked up a Neuer at 49. Based on the fact that Neuer is the cheapest 90 rated uh, apart from Neuer. The next closest to him is Courtois at 59. They're both goalkeepers. We've got a few German links coming into it now um, with the team of the week. Uh, we've got Havertz now, which is uh, in this team of the week, which could fluctuate, right? A few, uh, we've got, in the prediction, I think we've got, uh, yeah, Werner, uh, which is going to be good as well. And there's a few German players that people are using as well, especially some ones to watch as a centre-back and things like that. So can possibly see uh, Noya going up just a tad um, but this is what I'm doing I'm not saying that this is going to work it's just to see if it does work and see if we can make some coins right um, we should make some fair amount of coins as of some team of the team uh, ones to watches um, let's have a look at new players um, yeah, start looking at these ones to watches. Uh, I like Delit because Bayern Munich on fire, so he's definitely going to go to an 86. Netherlands will probably get a win in the World Cup, which will be an 87. Um, so you're looking at about an 87 there, and then on the hype of that, 129 could be actually pretty good. Bergwijn, someone said they invested at 11k or something into him. Really good price. Uh, Ajax are obviously going to get the thingy. Same with the World Cup. So he's looking at probably like an 84 or something, because I don't think it goes to an 81, I think it goes to an 82. Then it might go to an 84 and 83. So the hype of that will send him up as well. Um, Jesus, Arsenal on fire. So Jesus could be another one that um, you want to look into. Maybe pick him up earlier than Thingy because as the game's gone and as they start winning, um, yeah, you might start seeing them cards rise. And Talisa as well. Uh, what am I doing here? Leon ain't on the... They're not on the... Um, the best run at the moment, but the only I think I can honestly see this card getting a couple of upgrades. Definitely, one he's French, so he's bound to get some kind of upgrade, and um, Leon should get some wins. So yeah, I can see that card potentially going up, which would be good. Um, probably try and get him as cheap as you can, 10, 5, 10, 10, 10, 7, 50, something like that. Put him in the club. If you've got enough coins, put three or four in your transfer list and wait on that. I think that would be uh, that would be a good one to go to. And I'm not really, I haven't really been looking into the higher tier cards because I haven't got the coins for it yet. Uh, we should be up there though. Once we've sold all this, rewards are going to be coming out. We've got Phil Foden, who I don't know if he's going to be in the team of the week or not. 
which he should have had in this game. I think he should as well. Um, I'm not really sure, but his team of the week should be up there. All right, and be expensive. So, um, and he's still quite expensive himself. So I can see Foden, just like with Renato Sanchez and players like that. I can see this car potentially going up. I'll try and get him a little bit cheaper than what he is. I think he's 31. Um, you know, try and get him for about 30k, like 27k. Um, we bid on that there. That's not a bad one. We probably won't win that. There's one for 25 there as well. Someone's bid it. Yeah, someone's won that. There's 28 there as well. Uh, and I'll watch that one as well. But yeah, um, maybe Foden would be a good price. Who knows? But that is all I'm going to do. I will see if it pays off. Um, I'm not telling you guys to do that. I'm just saying that's what I'm doing. Um, so yeah. He, yeah, he just sold, and then we like that one as well. So yeah, we'll probably make a video in the next couple of days. Anyway, we'll have a video out tomorrow, but we'll see where we are on the whole flip side. See you in the coins, and I'll see you in the next one, boys. Peace.